think one of the responsibilities as a leader is to um, pass on instructions and guidance to those who may be up under you in some way, shape or form. And so that is the, the basis of, of mentorship. The Western North Carolina Conference of the United Methodist Church Adventures in Ministry matches mentors like you with emerging adults to help them discover and connect their passions to God's call in their lives. It's helpful to have somebody to kind of talk me through what challenged them and how they, they work through those challenges. My mentor helped me utilize almost every gift I possess. To walk alongside people in their journeys is such a blessing. Spiritual mentors and mentees may spend time together in person. They may communicate through text messages or emails. As long as the mentor can provide an inspirational space to listen and help discern and nurture God's call for their mentee. One of the things for me that is so important in mentoring is I just want to pay it forward and I want to give it back, what was given to me. Ten weeks after my internship began, I realized I was less sure what my call was, but I was way more sure that I have a call. The one-year structured program focuses on rising ninth graders to high school seniors. Mentors are vital to the process of helping these young adults make the next best steps in life. And a lot of times it's not so much using the exact answer that my mentor had, it's more of using tools that my mentor used to find their answer so that I can find my specific answer. We who have gone through some of the things they've gone through, some of the things they're experiencing, uh, to share that knowledge with them and that wisdom we've gained over the years that they might be this new emerging group of people that love Christ and, and able to take that love and share it with this world. To learn more and get involved in the Adventures in Ministry program, go to adventuresinministry.org.